Hey guys, EBP Man here, and today we're going to do the first official unboxing of the iPhone 7 Plus. Let's go ahead and check them out. So I have with me uh, the iPhone 6 Plus box, just so you can see um, any of the differences that may be or not apparent uh, when you look at the box. So everything is uh, pretty much the same, except the difference is that this is a 128 version versus the 64 gig. Uh, there are, is a black version, so if you did get the um, jet black version, which is the one that's a fingerprint magnet, the case or the box would have been black. In this case, this is the black version that's not the uh, glossy version, so this is coming in the standard packaging. So as you can see from the packaging, um, nothing much is change everything is about the same except the box is just a little bit taller all right so now let's go ahead and do the unboxing and we'll see and Apple's been pretty consistent they have a really simple unboxing process so here you have um, safety information and information about the the phone I'm sure with um, little Apple stickers and whatnot uh, we have the phone and the phone um, wrapped in plastic how it typically is and you can see that it's the black uh, version so this is the back uh, matte version I'll call it um, nothing much changed there you do see that you have like the dual speakers on the bottom and no headphone jack you do um, have some headphones here these are the wired headphones but here you have the adapter so make sure that um, if you want to be able to use your legacy adapters or headphones that you have this adapter right here so that's going to allow you to use that and these are the standard um, earbuds. Uh, here you have your uh, traditional uh, cable, uh, lightning cable, and your power brick. Pretty much that's all there is to it. So this is like one of the fastest and shortest unboxings. Now I think that there's no surprise by now about some of the changes that have happened with the iPhone. So I'm just going to be very brief and not spend a lot of time on them. Uh, you do note that at the very bottom here you do have um, the uh, speaker grill. Uh, you have now the um, only uh, proprietary jack uh, for using this phone is this port right here, uh, which means that if you are in the car, you're not going to be able to charge the phone and listen to music at the same time unless you're connecting with it via Bluetooth, which I hope everybody is. But if you have one of those cars that doesn't have Bluetooth, then you know, you'll have that problem. Um, and then uh, the reason why I'll be only reviewing the 7 Plus on the channel is because really the 7 Plus, I think, has the most significant upgrades, and that's the dual camera that we'll be seeing and we'll do some comparisons and see how that works and then uh, you know obviously there, there's some processor changes as well as this um, button has changed slightly outside of that um, everybody's upgraded to iOS 10 so what we'll do is we'll start up the phone we'll set it up and then uh, we'll see how it works so this concludes our quick unboxing and initial just um, overall overview of the iPhone uh, 7 Plus. Um, I will now be doing iPhone reviews for accessories, so screen protectors and additional cases that have come in, like cases from Spigen, as well as several others that are still coming in. I have the full line of UAG cases coming in, uh, so stay tuned and watch the channel. If there are any manufacturer products that you're interested, cases that haven't shown up on the channel, screen protectors that haven't shown up, any kind of accessory, please leave it in the comment area and I'll do my best to contact the companies to see if they'll send it to the channel. And as always, if you like this video, give it a thumbs up. Don't forget to share and subscribe. And again, thanks for watching.